Welcome back to Quiz Plays Battle Brothers, where uh, we're picking up right where we left off. This this company is doing very well. I'm very happy with it. So, hopefully, it's gonna go to the long run. And we, we again we switched back to beginner, but I'm very happy with that. We were we were really struggling on not beginner, so I'm okay being you know on beginner again. It's it's a smoother it's a smoother run for me. And as we as we learn, I'll, I'll learn to move to expert eventually, because it, it's it's better. You just fight more stuff, which means you can scale faster if you're skilled enough. So I want to do it, but. We'll see, we'll see. I haven't touched my last Battle Brothers save for a little while now. I was far along in my modded Legends Necro run. It's not as necro as I had hoped, but it's fun, been fun. I'm not doing any mods, of course, but it's really good. It's really, really good. It's, um... It's... it's Battle Brothers is such a fun game, and I've never seen this before, so let me see this. While counting inventory, fully coolly, uh, the hybrid joins your side. I'm honestly picking the sword or that shield. Um, picking at this sword or that shield, you set your quill, your quill pin down and ask him what he's uh, for. Is he sure he isn't here to count anything? He explains that another company wishes to use his sword hand. They're willing to pay more. You ask how much, and he uh, you ask how much, and he holds up his hands to count. They're talking fifty six crowns a day. He's earning fifty four with you. Hmm. I don't want to lose him. Can I? I'm just gonna pay him. I'll just do it. <sighs> This sucks, man. You sigh, the man nods and starts to leave, but you stop and you'll pay that amount so we can stay. The butter brother simply cannot afford to lose a man like him. That sucks so bad, dude. He's like, he's like all my pay. He's like a quarter of my pay goes to Fooly Cooly. Um, he's good, but he's not like, he's, he's not that good. He just has good base stats because he's a, a sellsword. I'm probably going to retire him eventually, honestly. Like, that's so much money. Like, he's got 19 battles with 18 kills. He's got to kill a battle nearly. He's, he's like, he puts in work, but he's not going to scale. Fully Cooley will not make it to the late game. Demanding extra wages, no good stars, bad trade. I mean, he'll, he'll get retired eventually. Um, I thought I was trying to battle these thieves. I thought I clicked on battle. I must have clicked move. Dude, we're, we're chasing them so far. This is such a scam. This is such a scam, dude. We need the scout. This is why I want the scout. Like, it's just that if you could just move slightly faster, you can gain so much time out of it, I promise. This looks really weird because you can't see the other bro, but you can see his weapon. There's just a bro down there, I promise. I mean, they're just, they, these guys suck. We'll kill them. Um, I hate the, the UI there or whatever, the camera. Um, but they're they're very weak. They're not moving in either. Are they trying to, to like form a, a protective core around their 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 archers or whatever? They're 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 rock slingers. They don't they don't have enough slingers to make that work. Um, like that's I get the idea or whatever, but they can't. They need more. They need more archers for that. I I am I am a more potent um ranged threat than they are. This this will not work out for them. I'm pretty sure. I'll step up a little so we can get our archers in range and stuff, but. I, I can. I think we can just win throwing my javelins at him. Like Cloud and uh, Cloud and uh, Fooly Cooly can get it done. Hmm, whatever. I guess actually we our did we did lose our did we did lose Orez the zero. We did lose our um our crossbowmen. So we do only have two. We're slowly schmoving at each other. This is the slowest walk up though. It, it, we are we are just very very slowly creeping at each other. It is absolutely the slowest walk up one could ever like hope for. Um, but it's it. I don't know. I think it's to my advantage. I'm fine with it. It's just so goofy looking. People normally move a little faster. Like you know, you normally move like all the way in in just a turn or two. Okay. Spear walls because they could move in now. They could they could meet us. There's there's room for it. So I'll spear wall here. Uh, you, I shouldn't have skipped your turn, but I guess you're just useless. We did just hire you, so I should. I shouldn't just be letting the new guy just do nothing. He should he should be earning his keep, um, and you know, getting exp and stuff. So I should I should move him in. I don't know. He was just like low. I was like, oh, you're not getting anywhere. But that's dumb. That's not the way to do that. Okay, getting some some damage done. And if they just keep missing their rocks, then it's all pure upside. You know, if they if they miss for like multiple turns, then we're we're just gonna you know kill a couple dudes before the fight begins. And that that rock you can't stand on. I'm almost sure. I haven't hit B, but yeah, okay. I thought I thought you couldn't, so we're gonna move around to the bottom here. And they do have a golden dag. It's a good weapon. I was I was not respecting it straight away, but now that I now that I know a little bit about it, I respect it. Oh, 
Okay, javelin, maybe get a kill. We missed the target, but we hit someone else. We did it twice, all right, get wrecked, dude. That guy's like, what did I do to you? Why did you stab me and me alone? Guido can just, I guess, go there. I wanted them to go over there, but they couldn't make it. You can stay there. That's fine, and then you need to get up somewhere. Yeah, you need to, you need to join the battle, Thorbin. Thorbin, get in there with us, brother. You're just staying behind. Okay, um, I'll schmoove you in. Get a little stab in. Okay, so this is this is a, an easy fight. Um, they, they have high ground on some positions, but it's not really a big deal. I don't think I'm in under under any threat. We should have enough DPS to just kill them, like regardless of their their high ground advantage. Do you have Pike Mastery, Javonin? Javonin? Um. Because you shouldn't have been able to attack there. You do. Let's go. Or polearm mastery, whatever. Um, because he, he moved two tiles. I didn't think he was gonna get the attack, but polearm lets you. That is sick. That's I. It's been a long time since we've had a, a campaign or a company with uh, with brothers that were high enough level to like you know get mastery. So it feels really good. It feels good. It is quite a nice change. I appreciate it greatly. Get some stabbing. Yo, 84% hit chance. That's really nice. That's like a lot. That's a lot of hit chance. Okay, but I would love if we could get people up to um, Duelist and Battleforged and stuff. Just because, like I was saying, it's been so long. We haven't we haven't had a Battleforged bro in like like weeks. It's been forever. I want I want it to happen. And this guy's got some tanky gear on. He can, he can take a stab or two. He's fine. They're mostly fleeing. We've already pretty much won. Might as well still try to kill him, though, for, for EXP. No reason letting them live. Ooh, and the new guy got a kill. Let's go. I guess I could have tried to stab through uh, the armor instead of, like, at the armor. Um, yo, the full flea. That was so cool. Seeing all their flags raise at the same time, that felt really good. It felt like I did something right, honestly. That that felt like like I'm successful. It felt very sick. Okay, this was a great fight. This it's this is fun. Like it just just winning this heavy handedly, like just dominating like this, just it, it'll never get old, chat. This is a feeling that will never get old. Alright, that was sick. A level on Mortimer. Mortimer's been with us for a little while, but not too long. I think they're a good character, if I remember. I think I liked them pretty well. Happy to see them level it. Mortimer Drock. Yeah, they're okay. They have the defense stars. Oh yeah, are they gonna be my my proper banner lord eventually? No, no, no. Oh yeah. Cloud, you have three stars on resolve. Oh, I was gonna make Mortimer into the banner lord because they're they're a better hybrid. Okay, I remember. I remember. I remember. So there was a little bit of lag there. Sorry about that. So I will give them resolve. They, they, they will be the banner lord. So we actually have a pretty resolved up team. Um, like we have a couple people with high resolve. Because you were you were the initial banner lord. Like just as like an off brand. You just had high resolve to start. Um, and then Cloud because the three stars. And then you will be the actual banner lord because you're really good at like hybriding. Or you will be. I um, mean you actually. This is enough. Like 49 is enough to give you. Um, well fast adaptation. But to give you uh, uh, some javelins. Do we have some? No? We'll get some. We'll get some. Do we have a, a proper ranged bro at all? Because you know what I was thinking about last night? We talked about this forever ago. Battle bro skis, indeed. We talked about this forever ago, though. Um, I could I could have a dude with two crossbows. Or, like, three crossbows. And he could just have um fast hands to, to fire, swap, fire, swap, and then fire, swap, and then reload, like, later. Um, so I kind of want to try that. I want to try a multi-crossbow character. I think that could be fun and cool and maybe really good. Uh, but I, I love Battle Bros. Walsh, but we've been having a lovely time with it. Um, it is so fun. It is so very fun. Okay, and we killed the people. They're happy. The people are happy we killed the other people. The people that we didn't kill are stoked about the killings. We've looked at this a lot. There's no one here. We have 12 people anyways. I'm not at the point where I want backups. Is good game. I agree. I agree. Is very good game. Is good is fun. selling stuff. I don't think we need all this stuff. We'll keep these. They're, they're slightly nicer. And these we bought, of course, and we'll buy these. This is worth buying. 124 is a little rich, but not not too bad. Not too bad at all. 
It's not too bad at all. Oh, we sold some gems here, apparently. I don't remember doing that. What is the contract? Do you want me to go, like, slightly to the south for a bunch of money? Whoa, that is a bunch of money. It's very far to the south, though. Skandergard? Where's Skandergard? Is it, like, all the way down here? Hey, Dan Dan the Tool. Welcome on in, Dan Dan. How you doing? Welcome on in, Dan Dan. Hope you had a lovely raid today. Hope you had a lovely raid. Welcome on into Dan and the Raiders. Hope y'all are doing well. I am uh, I am Quist Gaming. We uh, we, sh we stream a, a lot of games. We're a very family friendly, very positive community. I'm sure y'all fit right in. But how are you doing today, Dan Dan? What were you streaming, man? Good morning to you. Let me give you a shout out. Shout out to Dan Dan. Played some demon stoles. Played it till I threw the headphones. Rip, rip, rip. Well. I've never actually played Demon Souls. I've played, you know, uh, Dark Souls and Elden Ring and Sekiro, but I never played Demon Souls. So, I have no, I have no idea what what a specific encounter you could have been doing. But that sucks to hear. I hope you had a good time before you know you had a bad time before it became too frustrating. I hope it was fun. But I definitely understand those games are very frustrating. I don't think we're gonna pass by Grief and Wall. I, or I think you pass by. I don't think you go through. So. Sekiro's my favorite. Elden Ring is also great. I haven't beat Elden Ring yet. We're playing it like right now. We'll play it later today, actually. Um, but it's I think it's my favorite so far. Sekiro probably was my favorite before. I don't know. Souls 3 was also really good. But I think Elden Ring is my favorite. Um, it's just good. But it is really long. I'm at the point where I wish it was a little shorter. And we're not even like close to done. We still have like plenty left to do. We're going through like no cities on the way there. Maybe shorts for our forest? There's a bunch of barbarians, too. I don't really want to fight 11. They're probably just thralls. Yeah, it's just thralls, but I don't want to fight them. Session was amazing. Just one janky boss fight, and that was enough for me. Yeah, I mean, at this point, what's it, like 25 years old or something? It's not shocking. There's a little, a little jankier in there. But I'm glad you had a good time with it. All right, and these are thralls with um, with dogs, so even even easier than thralls. You know, I loved Elden Ring, but I was happy when it was over. Yeah, it's it's just so long. Like it's just we're 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 literally like 80 hours into my playthrough, and I have like so much left. I'm like, oh god, I'll be here for a year. I didn't mean to rally. I pressed the wrong button. The last 10 to 20 hours was a slog. Aw, oh, that sucks. <laughs> so yeah, I might I might be you know feeling the same thing, but I I don't know. I'm loving it so far. I'm still having a good time, but. I, it, it, it is big, though. It is very, very, like, you know, large. There's a lot of game in there. Okay, kill a dog, hopefully. Nah, I didn't quite get there. For the dog. Oh, it's full fleeing. That's okay. That's okay. Mm, you can step down here and try to kill this one. All right, not even fleeing, but it's hurt. This man gets stabbed. And do you, do you know, uh, do you know Battle Brothers at all, Dan Dan? Is this game familiar at all to you? Because I didn't know about it until very recently, but I really enjoy it. Okay, well, the, the, have a good breakfast then, man. Have a lovely day. Thank you for the raid, Dan Dan. Enjoy your meal. Enjoy your meal. Thank you, thank you again so much for the raid. Alrighty, let's let's go, folks. But if anyone in chat doesn't know this game, um, it is it is a uh, you you form a mercenary company and do contracts for the different cities and stuff. Uh, looks great. Reminds me of Ogre Tactics. Mm, I don't know it. I don't know it. Uh, I've, I've heard of, like, I've heard the word before, but I don't know it. Uh, but you form a mercenary company, you play on, like, the hex grid, turn-based, um, and then there's, like, the overworld we were on before. But it's really good. There's a lot of depth. Uh, it's a very long, like, campaign. Um, there's many campaigns or whatever, like, many different starts, and each world is, like, uh, randomized. It's like a roguelike. Um, but it's really good. A lot of depth, a lot of replayability. Very fun. I recommend it. The premise of this game, is it on console? Um, I don't think so, but I don't really know. It, it might be on like Steam Deck, but I, I don't I don't know if it ever made it to, to like Xbox or anything. But I'm not I'm not sure of that. That is that is until I'm just kind of creating. Like that's not really very like I can't really confirm or deny. Okay, this was a really good fight though. Um the we've just been having some smooth fights recently. We've been fighting weak enemies, so that's part of it, but it Lots of lots of shots are landing and stuff. Feels good, man. Feels good, man. I'm shocked this guy isn't full flee. Like everyone around him is dead. I would I would be flee. Okay. This should I shouldn't have stepped in. I, I stepped too close. Got the negative accuracy. But this shouldn't take too long. Like this should be the final round. If this man somehow survives, he's a legend. If he survives a round, he deserves to just walk away. 
He deserves to just be able to be given a second chance at life. He's, he's, he's not even wearing armor. He's like, he's a naked man fighting a, an army of armored up, you know, mercenaries. He should, he should fall. All right, just give me a turn of someone up here. Someone nearby him. There we go. All right, let's go. Works pretty well on Steam Deck, but the most PC games too, outside of the outside of a lot of multiplayer things. Oh, okay, okay. So yeah, so it, it, it works on Steam Deck, which is like kind of a console. I don't know. You know, it's it's like it's not a computer, so it's a console in that sense. But I don't know. It's not like a full fully fledged console. We still might have to fight those eleven barbarians. But again, it's they they somehow passed right through us. Never mind. I was like I was like it's an expected to fight them, but it's if we had to, it wouldn't have been a big deal. We got to go all the way over here. Do we go through this city? Are we are we actually gonna pass through this city? We will, but it's nighttime. Is it dawn when we get there? No, it's still night. Dang it! I was really hoping for dawn. Technically a handheld PC, so it's not a console, really. Yeah, it's 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 weird. It's 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 in a weird little place. The Steam Deck. Okay, well here we go. We're at Skandergard. We've made it, and this is a lot of money. We made a thousand bucks. Ooh, twelve barbarians. Are you are you all thralls? And some yeah, some dogs. I would love to fight them. Again, that's that's like easy exp. If if they if they're nearby, like I can see their steps. Yeah, yeah, we might be able to fight them. No, the second Skanderguard company is they're taking my glory. They've stolen my honor and glory. Hey Lazy, how are you doing? Welcome on in Lazy Lovelace. How you be, man? How you be? How you doing, man? Ooh, a legendary pike or a named pike. Sir Baranor's heart spike. Um, Spectrum is special crafted, blah, blah, blah. Seems good. Seems good. I like it. I would love to own it, but we're too poor. I am far too poor for that. It's a full links uh, desktop mode, and you can install Windows if you want. I didn't know that. That's cool. And I'm going to give you a shout out, Mr. Lazy Lovelace. Y'all probably know Lazy, but if you don't know, please, please check him out. If you don't know Liz Lazy Lovelace, check him out. Check him out. He's a good friend of the channel. Up a little late today. I was so tired. Hope you're doing good this morning. I'm doing very well. I'm doing very, very well. I am doing very well. Ooh, three. Three legendary armors. They're all too expensive, but that's a lot. Bleak Wolf's Honor. All right. 18 for 258. Cell Swords Headpiece. Oh, just Cell Swords Headpiece. Just a mercenary headpiece. Um, good, good armor. And this, actually, I like these more. I like the light ones more. 140 armor for negative five fatigue seems insane. Um, so I would I would like that, but we're too poor. But we did buy one. We did buy a named item. This 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 hat, which again it's no no vision blocking negative six fatigue for 160 armor. I value it really highly. I think it's good. I think it's the good stuff. Oh wait, that level. How long have you had a level for, brother? Thorbin, why aren't you leveled up? Okay, Thorbin. Mmm, you, you kind of suck with it, eh? Okay, two, two, man. You have 60 attack to start with, and plus two is okay. We'll give you fast adaptation so you can hit pretty... Because you won't get that high on attack, so you'll hit, like, relatively consistently. And with, you know, three-star health, they could be okay. They could be okay. They could they could get some work done. I'm going to move them over, though, so it's more they're more centered there. Oh, and we want, jav we want javelins for Mortimer. Do we have javelins here? Someone must sell them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you paying good? No, you're paying terrible. Jeez Louise. Like actual scammer prices. I'm going to buy some ham. We're here. I don't know. Might as well buy some ham. Okay, let's have a drink and let's go. Let's go. So many people are in a good mood from that. We could get a dog. I'm just going to send it. I think we have a dog and I like never use it. I've used it like some. Um, So let's go back to the, the cities we can trade with. that I Hopefully ones that I've already been to. Like I've already done some quests for. Oh, that's a citadel. Hedstead, yeah, Hedstead loves us. And this city used to love us, but then we robbed them on accident, so rip. Um, so we'll, we'll stop by here. Uh, maybe we can get some trade goods. We'll go to Fletchenstein, Fletchenstein, maybe buy or sell, I'm not sure. And then we'll we'll go to one of these two for quests. And maybe maybe Nazenfels has some quests for us, but maybe, maybe not. Hey, some weird sins, how are you doing? How you doing, sins? Welcome on in. I love the Hey Guys emote. Em emote? I don't know why I had an L to that. But I love the Hey Guys emote. It just, it hits different. It's a classic, and it's a good one. What you got for me? Master requires your services. Obtain Flute of the Debaka? Yeah, I'll, I'll go kill some stuff. I'll do it. Back to Battle Brothers already nice. Yeah, I yesterday when I looked at the schedule, I was like, oh, we're not going to play Battle Brothers for like four days. I was like, we'll just yeet Stone Shard. I've been, I've been taking a little break from Stone Shard recently. 
Um, I don't hate the game or anything. I'm not like done with it. I just, I got, I was, I was a little tilted with with my consistent deaths. I was a little frustrated with myself, so I wanted to just give myself a breather. So sadly, the schedule is kind of taking an L. It's not, um, it's not really accurate. But as as a result, we're getting some more Battle Brothers. Tell with that, so playing Battle Brothers, a man of culture, I see. Yeah, like like Battle Brothers is a game that isn't full of tilt and death, but um, it's it's better than Stone Shard, man. Stone Shards, it's it's rough sometimes. Stone Shard just hits different. You know the ruins to find the food box easy enough. You turn around, the false king must die. All right, all right. So we don't actually have to do this fight, but it's just some ancient auxiliaries, probably. I could kill ten soldier boys. Soldier boy, tell him. Really? What? Really? What? What's really? What are you? What are we really? What did I say that was so shocking? The complete opposite. Oh yeah, I don't. I don't find Battle Brothers that tilting. I'm very untilted by it. But um, my recent deaths in Stone. I'm normally not that tilted by much, but Stone Shard's been. You know, it's been doing the work to tilt me. But way easier time in Stone Shard than Battle Brothers. It's it's been like like. Wait, when did the skeleton update come out? The new skeletons and zombies. I don't know the exact date. I haven't made it to a tier three the whole time. I think I've done one tier three dungeon since then. I just keep dying at like level five. So I've been rather frustrated. I see my turns in a row in Battle Brothers. It just makes me feel some type of way. I don't, it does. It honestly doesn't bother me. Part of the reason it doesn't bother me is the, the, the you can see the rolls. The fact that it shows me like uh, the rolls makes me feel good. I don't even know why. But just seeing them, just it just, I don't know, it makes me feel like less, less bad when I miss. Okay, and we were dealing like a lot of pierce chance or pierce damage, so they'll resist it, but that's okay. We're slowly transitioning off spears. We've reached the, the point of the build where we're not just purely spearing it up all the time. But we're not quite transitioned out yet, so there's a lot of spears here still. We got some other stuff, though. Some. Not much, but some. Some sort of solids try soon again soon. I would recommend it a night alone. I would recommend it, dude. It's really fun. It's very fun. I shouldn't say dude to you. Um, I don't know if that's a title you like, but it's really good. It's 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 weird, you know. It's niche. It's tough. It, it's punishing, but I love it. I really really love it. Again, it's recently it, it took the place as my most played game on Steam. Previously, dude is entirely accepted. All right, let's go. Uh, but previously it was PUBG of all things. Um, but it, it's now Stone Shard. It's taken the, the 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 crown of my most played game, which it totally deserves. It deserves more than PUBG, and I shouldn't say that. I had a lovely time playing PUBG really early on, when it was like a you know like a, a in the beta, uh, in like kind of a clunky mess. I really enjoyed it. I played it with my bros quite a lot. Me and some dudes I worked with at the time. I would I would play with him and his his cousins. I didn't know his cousins, but you know we would just game together, uh, and it was it was fun. So I shouldn't hate on it. It was fun while I was playing it. Might not like love it anymore, but it was good then. That's dope. It was really fun, man. I loved PUBG for a while. I, it was it was it was a clunky mess, and that's what made it so cool. I liked it. Sounds like a good time. It really was. It really was. But alas, now 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 Stone Shard is taken over. It is my number one most played. And Stone Shard is sick. It, like I was saying, it easily deserves the slot as most played on Steam. And to be fair, some of that time is just AFK. Stone Shard's a game I can, you know, leave on my computer open and not feel bad. It's not going to run it very hot. You could leave Stone Shard open and your computer, like, wouldn't really know. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess if you have, a, like, a, a potato or a really old computer, it might be pretty rough. But most of the time, your computer can handle Stone Shard pretty easily. Seth with, with COD for 1 and 2 when I was younger. I played a, a pretty fair bit of Call of Duty. Potata. One of the potata. Potata computer. Um, I played a fair bit. But I preferred, like, zombies over, over like, multiplayer. I played a lot of zombies with the boys. Then fell out of SPS games. Yeah. I still I still like them. Uh, like, I want to play CS2 and stuff. But I'm not, like, really into them. I'm not a huge, like, you know, first-person shooter gamer. Rocking crazy headshots. Why are you fleeing, my man? But, but, but Why? What happened to you? Ernst, do you have no resolve? What do you look like? Okay, you're wearing a, a male coif. Ernst, yeah, you're fleeing. Okay, you have, like, rather low resolve. 
But why? Maybe maybe the bleeding or something? Why is he we're, we're destroying? I know skeletons are scary, but like, dude, this is a very successful fight to be fleeing from. You should take them pretty seriously. My kid was more in real life things. It was bad. I understand that. I definitely understand that. I remember I was like 15 and I went over to my friend's house and he was really good at Call of Duty. And I just played some Call of Duty while he was like asleep. It was like late at night or something. I don't really remember. But um, when he woke up, he was like, you played some Call of Duty or whatever? I was like, yeah. And he was like, uh, he was like, did you play online? And I was like, yeah. And he was like, no, did you really? And I was like, yeah, why? He was like, my KD, bro. And I like lowered it because I, I was just gaming. I was just playing bad. And he was like upset with me because I, I, I did damage to his KD. I totally understand it. I totally understand it. Ancient dead have fearsome. I, I, I do know. Yeah, they're, they're, they're extra scary or whatever. I did know that, but like, I just, I didn't think he would get scared. Maybe he was surrounded by people for a minute or something. Maybe he got like, like super, super surrounded. Cause I just, it, I don't know. It seems like a weird time to be fleeing. One trend I was sad to miss was the armor style zombies involving scavenging games. Ended up with a thousand hours and seven days to die as an alternative. Yeah, I, I like, I like the, the zombie scavenging stuff. I like it for sure. I like stuff like that. Um, but I, I also, I never really played much of them. I never, I never really got into them. Okay, okay, okay. One, and then I can feel that poor kids were bullies a little. He wasn't mean to be. I mean, I guess, I guess unless you mean like bullies in game, just killing people for the KDA. I don't think that's bullying though. That's just being good at the game. I was never mad at folks when they dunked on me. Except for spawn camping, which they kind of took care of pretty quickly. It, it became tougher and tougher to spawn camp in Call of Duty. <laughs> Like 700 hours in Daisy. That's a lot. His rep is more important than his friends just having fun. I mean, honestly, I understand. Sometimes you take games, like, really seriously. Or, like, you know, I do. People do. You in general, not you in specific. Uh, but I, I get it. Sometimes you're, you know, you, you put a lot of effort into that game. And, then you know, whoever messes it up is, like, you know, they're they're taking away all your, your time and effort. So I understand. I wasn't mad at him. I was not angry for his anger. Oh, we got we got metal or like a male plate out of that? I don't think I've ever got one of those before. That's sick. And then I like their helmets. At least early game, they're good. Um, I think we've already like outclassed them, but their helmets are fine. And then we got a bunch of random stuff. We'll just sell it off. That was okay. That was fine. And we didn't have to retreat and stuff, you know, because we, we got the mission done before the fight. So I'm happy with that. One of those dudes that had Marathon and Ninja. I mean, I'll just run in one direction around the map and sh around the map and schmurder with a UMP or P90. I I don't remember what perks I loved the most. I don't know. Like I said, I was a pretty casual um, gamer. I, I did a lot of z zombies if I was playing Call of Duty. Okay, so do they have anything they want to sell though? They said it's cheap. Oh, they I didn't buy these. Let's go. I'm glad I didn't buy these because now I'm saving like 30 bucks each. Made like 60 bucks by not uh, selling those earlier. Um, they're not paying that much for the shields, so I won't sell them here. I will not sell them here. Do you have any cool weapons, though, now that we're in, like, a, a, a like a better, like, we like each other more? No. This would be sick. This would be sick. Oh, it's, it's actually it's just, like, a basic spear or something? Like, a war spear? 35 to 40 damage is just so low, but I would, I would like it. It was cheap. I thought maybe it would be cool. This would be even better. 89 to 111. Now, that's some damage. That is some damage. That is that is a lot, but alas, we are too poor. We can see we have a lot of stuff to sell. Oh, we did buy salt from them. They had more salt for sale. It like reset, cause we I, I didn't have any salt initially. Um, let's go. We have so much to sell. Just a stuff you can buy both before and after you receive the request. Oh, okay. I didn't realize that some weird sins. I yeah, and I apparently I did. Apparently I did buy before. So that's pog. That is super pog. Next to the running in Commando Pro thing, she, she thought that range on melee was fun. I remember doing the flashbang in hand because you could run faster. That's so funny. I didn't know that. Okay, I was just looking and seeing if someone sick was there for some reason. So let's go, um, I guess just to Fletchenstein, like I was saying. We'll try to sell there. Um, I knew, like, you know, knife out running was faster. I didn't know about the, the flash, though. But I loved zombies. I was good at it too. I could I could play a match of zombies with my with my bros or just online for like hours. Hey everybody, Quist Gaming here. If you're enjoying the content, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. It truly makes a difference. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.